Hello students, in this video we are going to study about another type of excavation equipment that is the clamshell. So what is clamshell? This clamshell name is due to the resemblance of its bucket to a clam which is like a shellfish with a hinged double shell. Here, the front end is essentially a crane boom with a specially designed bucket loosely attached to the end through the cable, same as in the drag line. The clamshell is used to handle loose materials such as sand, gravel, and crushed straw. Now, the clamshell is specially suited for lifting of the materials vertically. Here, the capacity is usually in cubic meters. This is the image of a clamshell. Now, the clamshell buckets are available in various sizes, that is, heavy duty type, medium weight type, and the light weight type. So, the heavy duty type is used for digging purpose, the medium weight type is used for general purpose work of excavation, and the lightweight type of the clamshell is used for rehandling of the light materials. Now, the manufacturers of the supply bucket are either weak, the removable teeth, or without the teeth. That is, the clamshell have teeth. Why did teeth are used? Now, the teeth are used in the digging of the harder materials, but are not required when the bucket is used for light duty. Now, we will see the operation of clamshell. First process is the clamshell bucket is brought over the location where the material is to be dug. Then the bucket is lowered with the shelf open till the good contact is made with the ground. Next, the weight of the bucket enables it to dig into the material, thereby filling it. Now, what gets filled into the bucket? The bucket gets filled by the excavated hole. Now, the bucket is hoisted and swung to the position of the dumping and then the contents are dumped into the dumping truck or dumping vehicle like this. Now this cycle is repeated. Here is a typical diagram of a clamshell bucket. Here we have two shells and there are teeth attached to the shell. So this is, this is the clamshell bucket with the teeth. Now, what are the factors affecting output of clamshell? The first is the difficulty in loading of bucket, then the height of lift, angle of swing, method of disposing of load, and then the experience of operator. Now, the applications of clamshell. For, for what purpose the clamshells are used? Now, for, after watching all the slides we have seen, we can Take a general idea what can be the application. The first is that it is commonly used for handling loose materials or the lightweight materials such as crushed stone and gravel. And another is that the vertical lifting. So the main feature of the clamshell is the vertical lifting of the material from one location to other. And the last application is that it is mainly used for removing of the material from proper dams, fever, man holes and well foundation. Thank you.